Hey everybody, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you how to potentially, potentially, maybe not, but hopefully fix the error that you have while trying to start up Player Unknown Battlegrounds. Um, if you're like my friend here, he had the problem with uh, the game crashing at the startup. Um, so what you're going to want to do first of all, is you want to go here, you want to go into your control panel settings, and you want to go to update and security, okay? And we're going to check for updates and update the files for the NVIDIA drivers, everything like that that's going to be underneath there. That's going to be the first thing. Restart your computer to try that. Um, second thing you can try doing here is what we're going to do, actually, is while we're still in this screen, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go to folder options. And so we'll just type in folder options. And we're going to go change search options for, folder, for files and folders. And then we're going to go to the view tab right up here. And then what you want to do is you want to, right here, it's usually going to show, don't show hidden files, folders, or drives. But you want to check show hidden files, folders, and drives. And you're going to click apply. Okay, because that's going to be later on in the video here for the reasoning behind that. All right, but step number two, um, what you want to try doing, we'll go into Steam and right-click the Player Unknown Battlegrounds game. Go down to Properties, and we are going to go to Local Files. And we are going to verify the integrity of game files and let that run through and if anything's missing it should fix that from there so that's step number two all right and if that doesn't work step number three there will be a link down in the description on how to do it so what you're going to do is once you get it downloaded it's going to open up something like this right here this is what it's going to be it's going to be game user settings okay um so we're going to keep that We'll drag that off to the side here for right now, and we will do that. Um, actually, I'm going to minimize it. But anyways, what you want to do then from there is you are going to want to go into your folders down here, your file explorer, and you are going to want to go to this PC, wherever your game is saved at. We'll go to Windows C, that's where mine's at, and then we'll go down to Users, double-click Users, and this is from the step before, this is where we need, we, we are going to need this. So we're, then we're going to go to, you know, the, the computer name. And then we are going to go down to app data. That is one of the hidden folders. That is why you had to uncheck that. And then we're going to go to local. And then from there, we will go ahead and we will find TSI game. Okay. Double click TSI game. We will go to save. It will go to config. <laughs> yep so saved config windows no editor and then we're going to go down to game user settings we're going to double click that open that what we're going to do is we're going to take all this out and we're going to delete that and then we're going to take the other file and we're going to copy these from the file that you downloaded and you're going to paste it into the blank uh user settings and then we're going to close out of that and then that should potentially work. The game should be fixed and the game should be running for you. You might load up at a lower resolution, but the game will start for you. And then you can change your settings once you get into the game. Um, if there's any issues, problems, anything like that, um, let me know. I'll try to continue to work on this fix. Um, and if it did work, please like, subscribe, tell your friends, post it. Help other people out the best that you can. And uh, we can try to get everybody playing play our known battlegrounds because it's a fantastic game and um like i said i hope this helps and i hope to see you all on the battleground soon and happy hunting